you catching them finally working? Yeah, that's why I'm getting it on video. So I can prove to everybody. It's the same grit, but in this half inch thick, again, it's not sandpaper, it's grain bonded right to the foam, really flexible. And you see what that's going to do. Holy crap. Alright, so first thing I'm going to go around the outside on a slight angle, very light pressure. Then I'm going to take it on the back. Drop down in the middle. Get my head to the side. I'm done. I'm ready to put stain on. Now with that fine sponge, prep my MDF with it. Sand First coat of primer is pretty rough anyway. Then for my second coat, in both cases. For sealer, I'm going to use super fine in this guy. And I'm going to use super fine on my last coat before top coat for MDF. So you got three sponges of fine, fine, and super fine. Those fine and the thick and thin, and then super fine and thick only. We've got all kinds of options, but that's all you really need is those three. That's going to do like 99% of what you want to do. With the fine sponge, we got a brown holding. I love this thing in my hand in here. It's, it's not normally feasible. You know everything you're bouncing around in your hand? What's that? It's super fine, right? And very good. Take care of each step higher. So now for what thing I want to show you. I think you guys probably have, we sold you some yeah, of these things, yeah, interface yeah, pads. Yeah. What, you won't really need them too much anymore, except for like stuff like this, where you want to take hey, Tony. fine pad, I slice the piece of that off, put it in the middle, put it on there like that. Now, I'm going to say the raised panel door. I'm going to just mark this thing so you see that it's actually working. Let's see what happens now, right? Help me reach down in there. Wow, that's cool. Right? Take the same interface pad. Let's center this guy, and let's take this guy and put him on the middle, and now it'll make this even easier. Are you getting the whole curve at the same time? Yeah. Just ways to make it more versatile. So with one tool with these options, you can do so many different things with them. And of course, you still got conventional if you need it. Yeah, like I said, it's really knife marks. Planer marks, take out the edge with that, yeah. go to the one sided, or sorry, the five mil thick, I should say, then you're half inch. That's the whole. It's five millimeter fine. Five millimeter fine. Then I just step this thing up like this. A half inch fine, right? Oh no. Up the front.
quiero poner a una persona a trabajar esto a mano y una con la máquina y vamos a ver, él va a hacer tres asientos mientras está haciendo uno. Gracias.